Too hot to be clever. I gotta cool down. I just gotta. Uh huh. Oh. Sorry, this coolness is taken. Oh. Oh. I knew I was a hottie, but come on. Big way, hot sand, hot sand, cannonball. Refreshing! Uh. Oh. <clears throat> Maybe I can interest you in a cool breeze? <sighs> oh, feels delightful! Uh, yeah. I'll pass. <clears throat> Aha! I know where I can cool down. In Rosebud's meat locker. Occupied. <laughs> Sorry. What a whiftacular day, huh, McGee? I feel so alive. Uh, just a figure of speech. <laughs> hey, how's Sawyer keeping cool? Just a dab to cool my bones. Not one dab more, or I'll explode. Now, that's a cautionary poem for anyone who might be watching me use this. <sighs> totally delightful, Flutter Eye. Hope I didn't miss any cautionary poetry. Ooh, refreshing. <sighs> Hyperhydrosil prevents total zombie body rot due to dried out sweat glands. Hmm, may contain tea tree oil and dried vomit flakes. Ew! <laughs> Tea tree oil? Huh. Ooh, tingly cool. <sighs> and all from one tiny little insignificant dab. Hmm. <laughs> oh, imagine how good a cool misty sea breeze would feel right now. Mm -hmm. Hey, it actually worked. Thank you, imagination. Yeah, and thank you, cool miss. You are both very welcome. Oh, no! Oh, yeah. Mmm, salty. Hey, I can't help cooling people off. Probably because of my cool personality. Or that zombie hyper sweat cream. You know one. No! I can taste the armpit. <laughs> All I know is the more I sweat, the more my body cools itself off. It's science! It's sweat science! And you can't argue with sweat science. I've tried. I'll disprove your theorem one day, sweaty abacus! Oh, yeah! Who needs water when you have a sweat shower complete with selection of sweaty settings? <laughs> You're welcome! Feeling a little dizzy. No, McGee, you're leaking like a busted latrine. And you smell worse. You can't stop sweating. Look! Shows you what you know. See? I can stop sweating whenever I will. Uh, 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 squirt! Uh, a little help? I'm on it. <sighs> ah, this is so Damn. not cool. I mean, sure, I feel cool, but oh, you know what I mean? I guess that explains this. Only zombies are supposed to use hypohydrazil because we don't sweat. If McGee doesn't stop sweating, and soon, he'll dry up and go full raisin. Uh, that's a zombie medical term, by the way. Huh? Oh, huh. it's starting! <laughs> Gotta keep you nice and hydrated. Welcome to the hyperhydrazil helpline. Thank you for holding. Please press 1 now if you'd like to order an I Love Hyperhydrosil t-shirt. If you've ignored...
heard our cautionary poem and are experiencing a case of full raisining, please press 2 now for the location of the nearest antipersimmon tree. The only known cure for excessive oversweating. You must head into the forest. That's right near here! Let's go! Hello? Hyperhydrocell helpline? Um, uh, one t-shirt, please. Look! The antipersimmon tree! Wow! That was way more convenient than I thought! If you don't mind, I'm clear-cutting valuable anti-persimmon here. Why would you want anti-persimmon? <gasps> Black Squad, do you also suffer from oversweating? Romeo! Romeo! Romeo? Hello? Forsooth! I am... Uh... I am... Uh... It's, it starts with an R line. Rhymes with polio. I say it all the time. What's my line? <gasps> Easy, Butt Squad. Keep cool. You know what happens if you lose your... <laughs> oh, looks like Romeo needs a deodorant -io. <laughs> <sighs> After the Sunny Smiles Theater reviewer called the performance Romeo and Julie Sweat, I vowed nothing would make me sweat again. Don't be ashamed. <laughs> What? You're uh, not planning to use all that anti are you, Butt Squad? I mean, I'm just asking in a breezy, casual, um, I don't need it oh so very desperately kind of way. Oh, I'm taking every little bit I can get. And this is why. Ah! Oh, phew, another layer. <laughs> that was close. What are those things anyway, Butt Squad? Ice cube making undies, my primary cooling off device. But the heat blew their delicate undie fuses. That's when I started hoarding anti-persimmon. Ah! Butt Squad, please! Please don't take all that anti-persimmon, because McGee needs some, too. <gasps> you? An over-sweater? I... Uh, as you can clearly see, every over-sweater knows it's not his fault. He's so disgusting. True. So, share the anti-persimmon, so McGee doesn't go... Full raisin! <laughs> huh, what do you know? The stereo still works. Oh, also. No anti persimmon for you! Now beat it, sweat bag! <laughs> no! I need that anti persimmon! No. Give me! Hand it over! It's mine! Oh, it's totally on. mine! Ew, you're so wet and sweaty! You're paying to dry clean my hanky and my remote. No, no! Don't make me sweat! You wouldn't like me when I sweat. <laughs> Sure thing, Julie Sweat. Yeah, we should have expected that. Hey, what's the deal, Bud Squat? It's a big, sweaty mistake. Hey, 
it's happening again. I'm on hold with the Hyper Hydrosil helpline. Thank you for holding. Your order has been processed. Your I Love Hyper Hydrosil t-shirts uh, will be shipped in. T-shirts? <laughs> I've been on hold for six hours for t-shirts? We'll all be the coolest guys in camp. <laughs> Get it? Cool. <laughs> She digs left, she digs right, she moves! It's gotta be a touchdown! Okay, I got it! No, I got it! I got it! Hey, hey, I got it! No, I got it! Oh, wow, I got it! I got it! Everything's coming up square! Uh, okay, is it just me or was this gigantic fence not here 11 minutes ago? Hey, like the fence bottom smellers? I got it custom made. Check it out! Stay out, bottom smellers! This means you! Repeat, stay out! <laughs> bottom smellers! <laughs> that one never gets old! <sighs> oh, by the way, you guys are on Lake Bottom Lockdown. Oh, come on. What are you babbling about now, Butt Squat? I'm babbling about your stinky pet Sasquatch. He was spotted in Sunny Smiles. That's a no-no. If I ever catch him there again, I'll turn him into a Sasquatch fur bath mat. <laughs> okay. First of all, butt cheese, Armand would make a way better area rug. And why would he want to be anywhere near you? <laughs> Uh, yep, that's him, all right. Arm band? Yes, arm band. The giant hairy arm band? That's what infiltrated Sunny Smiles, not her mind. Totally believable. Oh, no, yeah, yeah, right. Yes. Totally believable. See? Yeah, her mind really isn't cool. sneaking around your camp, huh? So, I'll just get my ball and be on my way. <laughs> hmm, a giant arm band, huh? <laughs> Yeah. I heard about those, obviously. Until I figure out what crept into my camp, this fence stays up, and nothing will ever cross it again! <laughs> Armand, you have to come out from there, please! Caught on video? Oh, what a rookie Sasquatch mistake! <laughs> oh, come on, Armand, cheer up! It's not that bad. Not that bad? <laughs> not that bad? Did you know the video went viral? Listen to these horrible comments. Grotesque creature, lumbering brute, bad mannered beast, oh! The world doesn't understand me. I'm not a monster. Okay, I am. But you know what I mean. You don't know how good you got it. I'd love to go viral. <laughs> good news, Mickey! This looks like it definitely went viral. That is not the kind of viral I meant. I meant that I'd be an awesome monster. Imagine it, people crying and running and peeing their pants in fear because of me. But what? This, this foot is terrifying. Oh, me. Armand must be really sad. He hasn't even come out to join the campfire or to take a poop break. Oh, yeah? Well, I got something that'll get Armand out of there. Ha! Ch -ch 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 Check it out. A Sasquatch sized s'more. Now that's grotesque. <laughs> yes, deliciously grotesque. A s'more, McGee. Really? That disgusting blob is not going to do anything for Armand. Oh, come on, Grouch. He's going to love it. <gasps> oh, okay, I can stay. Stay. It's... <sighs> Aw. <gasps> McGee! McGee? Uh, are you... Uh... <laughs> uh, <gasps> sounds like McGee's in trouble. Or it's a rabid gremlin. McGee! Calm down! We gotta get that hot goo off of you! Wait! Oh, no, 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 no. Butster, on patrol. 
Nothing gets past me. <laughs> well played, Smithywix. When do I get a turn? Be quiet. <gasps> My help. He'll never last as a freaky monster. Shh. No. Please stop screaming. Just head back. No, no, Cratch. We can't just give up on s'mores. I, I, I mean, s'mores. I, I mean, McGee? Yes, that's it. S'mores. <laughs> Wait a second. I really hope that's chocolate. Mm. Oh, it is. S'mores chocolate with just a hint of McGee's belly button lint. Should I even ask how you know what that tastes like? <laughs> Uh, he went that away. <laughs> I'm awake. I'm awake. <gasps> oh. huh? What's that? Oh. Oh. <gasps> it, it, it was awful. It was horrible. It, it was a half ogre, half tasty dessert. It, it, it was a smoker. A smoker? Not on my watch. I'm coming for you, smoker. No sunny smilers will ever be good again. Monster deal is getting boring. How am I supposed to horrify victims if they're all in hiding? Well, I might as well head back anyway. Fudge is starting to chafe. Attention, Smoger! You are strictly forbidden at Camp Sunny Smiles. <laughs> I'm what? I, no, 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 wait! I'm not the Smoger! I'm. You've been warned! Release the Smoger Melting Protocol! Correct, Smoger. It's steaming hot. Hot enough to melt you for good. No! Punchquad, don't melt me! I'm not a Smoger! It's me, McGee! Oh, yeah, I heard the... No, Butt Squad, don't melt me! I'm not a Smoger! It's me, McGee line, a thousand times. So just melt with dignity. McGee! Hands up! Yeah, we're here to save your delicious chocolatey hide. <laughs> I gotta help McGee. How do I do that without getting caught? Ah! I'm caught! <laughs> Smoker Vision Goggles, worth every penny. Freeze, Smoker! <laughs> Literally, liquid nitrogen, a dessert based monster hunter's best friend. <laughs> I did it! I caught the Smoker! I protected Sunny Smiles! I out McGee McGee! I wish he was here so I could rub it in his face! <laughs> Silence! Time to smash you into a million bite-sized smogers! Ha ha ha! I'll get you, smoger! <laughs> and your smoger sidekick too! 
Mogur sidekick? <laughs> Seriously? Ha <laughs> ha! How's that for grotesque? And Butsquat was none the wiser. Uh, Armand! You came out of hiding? Risked being captured? Wore a mask of belly button lint covered s'mores? Just for me? Oh, I know what it's like to be a monster and to be misunderstood. Besides, I learned something. It's okay to be a monster as long as you do it with style and panache. Now that can go viral. <laughs> oh, I'm so over being a monster, but this s'mores goo is totally frozen on. How do I get it off? Oh, I've waited all night for this! Mm. Oh. <laughs> I love cooking my Nana's special goulash. Me just a hint of hot. Spicy spice. And a dash of burnt nose hair. Now to make this a taste test. <laughs> Nana's golden ladle. <laughs> Still as shiny as it was in the olden days. Awesome! Hot sauce, what a balloon! Oh, Butt Squad will never see it coming. Oh, <laughs> itchy. So very itchy. <sighs> Thanks, Rosebud. I think I'll hold on to these for a while and see how they do in the yeah. bottle area. Are those my stick choppers? Uh, you could use these as chopsticks, but you'd have to eat around with swished fly goo. Good talk! On guard, villain! Or thou shalt feel it, the sting of Excalibrum! <laughs> That maketh me pierce my pants not. Behold, ex Hands off my stuff! Forsooth, yawn fun, be over it. Everyone with a stuff borrowing. Next, they'll want to borrow Nana's lucky golden ladle. Stealers, make this a coughing up of all my stuff! <laughs> oh, yes, uh, that's mine. Uh -huh. yeah. oh, <laughs> I should put that on ice. Oh, don't need that! <laughs> yeah. huh? I uh, need those back to cover my uh, bottle area. Wait! Nana's ladle! It's not here! I want Nana's ladle! Give it back, or else I make this a lockdown. Ooh, lockdown? That sounds pretty cool. Oh, so that's what lockdown means. Uh-huh. Uh We're missing all the fun. Being in lockdown is the worst. And done. Check it out. A unicorn? Uh, I don't know. I, I wanted something more dangerous. Oh, I love it. Locked down for a ladle-based crime I didn't commit. Worse, I really need to go number one. Where'd Rosebud put the John in this joint? Uh, you're not gonna like this. Huh. Oh, man. <laughs> How am I supposed to hold this in? For my entire sentence. Mm, you should probably skip lunch, too. Did someone say lunch? Lockdown lunch call. <laughs> Extra greasy. See how nice I treat you, even after you steal Nana's ladle? So, if you don't like the lockdown, all you have to do is return Nana's ladle and the fence will go kaput. Hmm. Okay, then. No freedom for you. Sawyer! No one knows the camp like you! You gotta know a way out. Come on! I can't hold it much longer! Sorry, McGee. Too busy. Ever since Rosebud activated the Lake Bottom Insta Prison Ultra Security feature, my chore list has gone through the prison fence roof. Pardon me, Sawyer, if you don't mind my asking. Why does Lake Bottom even have an Insta Prison Ultra Security feature in the first place? Oh, now that's a long, drawn-out, mildly interesting backstory. I'm glad you asked. 
It all started when... No time! We gotta break out of here and find that ladle! So I can finally whiz! <laughs> Fun preventing fence, meat, hardest object on Earth. Rosebud's meatloaf. Sayonara, fencerita! Oh, Ooh, smells good. Just a little more. Yes! We have squirt left off. Gotta get Gretchen's uniform washed before the gruel sets in. Hey, can we all try to keep this place tidy? Oh, not again! Sorry, Gretchen, but everyone knows electric eels work best on deep set gruel stage. <laughs> I've seen enough movies to know I can dig under the fence with just a toothpick. Uh, oh, the movies were never clear about how big the toothpick had to be. Yeah. <laughs> ah! Should have used less toothpicks. <laughs> Rosebud, we don't have your ladle. You can't deprive us of precious toilets. Or keep us stuck under the hot sun for the rest of our lives. Hmm. Yeah. Good point. <laughs> Thanks for the tip. <laughs> oh. Yeah. Rosebud's meatloaf. <laughs> It's causing a cell block riot in my stomach. Quiet in there! We don't have a place to poop, remember? Lights out! <sighs> Prison yard fresh. Sawyer, we've tried everything. We need to get out of here now. And you got to help us, please. But, McGee, I can't possibly think about prison breaks until that filthy sink is taken care of. What? Today was Shoulders Day. Sink taken care of. Come on, campers. Let's blow this joint. Uh, quick question. Won't Rosebud totally notice that we're gone? Don't worry about it. I got a guy working on the inside. Oh, good night, McGee. Good night, Grudge. Oh, you're my best pal, Squirt. Oh, yes, and I like you too, McGee. Sounds believable. Uh, I'm too bulked up to fit. <laughs> bad eagles, bad! Bottom sewers? That must mean we're directly under the lake bottom latrines! Oh, please don't say latrines! Hurry, campers! The latrine could flood these pipes any second! I said, please don't say latrines! <laughs> oh, I recognize this. When I had the Insta Prison installed, it came with a jailbreak preventing monster. <gasps> Sawyer! Why would you do that? That's another long, drawn-out mile. Still no time! We gotta get out of here. Hey, the coast looks clear. No monsters this way! Pointy! Moist! You oh. Uvula? <laughs> At least I don't have to go number one anymore. stuff would save the day and... Dear Rosebud's diary, you'll never believe what I saw today. Oh, look! The moon! Follow me to freedom! Freedom! Yeah, that's some terrible smelling freedom you found here, Gretch. <laughs> Find 
that ladle. Any ideas? Uh-uh. Nada. Nope. Yeah. <gasps> Maybe I tickle you till you tell me where it is. Rosebud, it was just a ladle! Just a ladle? There's nothing like its beauty. Its golden glow, its frizzy hair holding up powers. My Nana can't get herself. <clears throat> oh, yeah! Now I remember. I stuck it up there after someone took my hair defrizzing stick choppers. <laughs> I'm sorry for accusing you all. I'm such a silly villain. <laughs> well, at least no harm done, huh? No, no, I'm McGee, no, I'm Gretch, no, I'm everyone. Nothing's as relaxing as watching deadly explosions of fire. Ah. Oh, 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 this is it. Here comes the boom, boom. Hold on to all your butts. Already on it. Yeah. Let's get this party erupted. Ha -ha. Ah! Nice. Oh, man, total love a letdown. Never underestimate Mount Fit to Boom. Intense? Huh? Wow! <gasps> Gretch or You had me at binoculars. Oh, that, that line! I, I know that line! Yes! I mean, it's just our favorite movie of all time! <laughs> when when crime, crime is too far away to see, it's, it's time, time to, to get, get some, some binoculars! binoculars. Uh, Will you look at that, sweetheart? It seems as if we've got some fans. Only your biggest fans? You're our favorite action movie star couple! Huh. I'm the Gritchison's biggest fan. I even have a tattoo. It's on my body. Stay out of their sight, Armand. We don't want to scare the humans. Oh, please. What's so frightening about us? Right. Not that we're complaining, but why are you guys visiting Camp Lake Bottom anyway? To see our precious daughter, of course, Gretchy Kim. Gretchy Kim? <laughs> uh, yeah. Hi, Mom. Hi, Dad. And then there's this. I sleep there. Those are Squirt McGee's bunks. That's a shrunken head. Spider eggs, the usual. Interesting. It smells like the set of Invasion of the Mold Men from Mars. What? Welcome to Lake Bottom Macaroni Lays, our tradition. Yeah? Since when? Well, let's see. Since super awesome movie stars started coming to our camp, so today? Oh. Mickey, could you give it a rest? Oh, don't worry. We're used to it, dear. Make sure you get my good side. Where is that music coming from? We had sound systems added to our formal way. It just made sense. Ha! Okay, Gretch, what is the deal here? You are embarrassing us in front of your parents. Oh, and speaking of that, why didn't you tell us? Oh, come on, Gretch. Me and Squirt live for your parents' movies. Like Double Black Belt Shark Tap Out 4? Or Double Black Belt Shark Tap Out 5, the re-sharkening? Come on. Both classics in the giant shark versus human genre. Sorry, personally, I can't stand all that Hollywood nonsense. Whoa, nonsense? What are you saying? <laughs> and that's what you get for invading the White House. Ah, oh, now that brings back memories. Did you know that shark had a black belt in Taekwondo dorsal fin? Dad, Double Black Belt Shark Tap Out 5 was just a movie. Can't we all talk about real people stuff? For once. Real people stuff? Gretch, we talked about this. Stop giving your father frown lines. If I didn't know you better, I'd think you didn't want a visit from your action stars. Uh, you mean parents? No, that's exactly what I said. Oh, uh, happens every time. <sighs> Did someone call for parent participation? Stand up straight, dear. I promised myself I wouldn't cry. Out-pageanted, 
by my own folks. Aw, oh, there, there, Gretch. I'm here for you. <laughs> <laughs> wow! That was just like Spin Kick and Spin Kick Party 6, Mrs. G. My turn! <laughs> Best spin kick inflicted in turtle rupture ever. That's it. I am so out of here. <gasps> oh, what's with Gretchikins now? <coughs> hey, this is just like the set of Killer Cop Cloud Five. <laughs> <laughs> Gretchy Wetchy, is that you? <coughs> Can I get an autograph? A lock of hair, an extra kidney, perhaps anything? I'm your biggest fan! Woo! Okay, this is gonna be just like the final scene in Spin Kick Party 6. And oh, and don't be afraid to go for the Gritcherson eyeball crush. You got it! And watch out for the Gritcherson larynx twist, too! Have you seen Armand? You know how fan crazy Armand is. I hope he isn't chasing after the Gritcher's pants. Oh, don't worry. The Gritchersons can totally handle one crazy fanboy. <laughs> <laughs> Gretchen's folks are running scared. Straight from Mount Fit to Blow. And it's Fit to Blow. Oh, now I get it. Oh, the Gritchersons? Scared? That's impossible! They, they played every kind of hero that's ever existed! That's it! Squirt! They must be researching roles for a movie! Come on, remember how scared they pretended to be in Giant Gator 7? You've been accessorized! <laughs> Come on, Squirt! Those two acting geniuses are grinchersoning into the hilt, and we're missing it! Mom? Dad? Here we go again. Huh? Oh, see? I told you the Grinchersons could handle fanboy Armand. Uh-huh. Looks like a textbook Grinchersons larynx twist to me. Actually, I slipped in a puddle of the Grinchersons' fear snot as they were desperately running away. <gasps> and all I wanted was a few pics of them for my celebrity scrapbook. According to Gritchopedia, the Gritchersons practice kung fu yoga, don't eat pineapple, and poop 400 times a year. But it never said anything about running from fans! That's because it's acting, Squirt. If we split up, I bet we can find them before they wrap. <laughs> That's Hollywood talk. Come on! <laughs> Ran whatever that was. Time for a peace spot check. All clear. You too. Oh, nice work, dear. There you are. It's dinner time. Well, don't you want any of my famous stone soup? I loved you guys in Screaming Zombie Stompers 3D. Oh, how ironic. Get it off me! Get it off me! <laughs> Look, it's Gretchikins! Gretchikins! Gretchikins has come to save us! Gretchikins! <sighs> Please, get us out of here. So, it's true? You weren't just acting scared? but. But you wrestled sharks! You you fought mutant gators! You crashed a jet to get here! <sighs> Guess it's up to old Gretchikins to set the story straight again. Oh, I don't do slimy. Stop double! <laughs> you knew this whole time? Sure. You sent stunt doubles to all my birthday parties because you didn't trust the candles. <laughs> <laughs> Easy, guys. None of this would have happened if you acted like normal parents, even if you are the world's biggest cowards. You're so right, dear. Oh, Squirt, look at me. 
we can still love their movies, right? Even if the Christiansons are the world's biggest coward. <laughs> no, we can't. Ah, uh, yeah. Can't. Now, let's go before Mount Fit to Blow explodes. You can act not scared better than anybody! Okay, I can do that. And action! Thanks for saving us. Oh, and by the way, I did notice you borrowed the rescue scene from Lava Luau the Third. So you have seen your parents' movies, Gretch? Oh, only like a trillion times. See, I told you, you could act not scared better than any- ah! oh. <sighs> oh, this is so going in the scrapbook! Ah, picking the cookies. <laughs> Okay, sure. It's not what anyone expected, but Rosebud's got the sweet tooth. <laughs> What's me to hissing? <laughs> Cookies. Yes, please. Uh, they are not ready. The legend of the ancient cookie recipe clearly says, bake for 30 minutes. 30 minutes? Do you know how long that is? <sighs> Fine. I'll wait. <laughs> There was something I was supposed to be doing. Hmm. I said give it back, you furry bag of acorn stink! Oh, where is Squirt? Oh, can I eat them now? Eat them now? But they're still raw? Are you cracked in the skull? No! You'll get the worms. They do look pretty juicy. Now. The cookies will be ready for the chow down when this makes me the ding a ling ding. Und ding. Remember, 30 minutes. <sighs> or. thought about it, and we're all for forgiving you for the whole leaving us hanging thing. Right, Gretch? <sighs> there she! Uh, besides, forgiving pals is what us real pals do. And nothing ever comes between us real pals. Nothing will ever come between us. Junior, and and you'll be Slithery Pete. Oh, and you, 
Squirt Jr., the second! And you? Shh. There, there. Ah, <sighs> uh, Earth to McGee. There's something different about Squirt today, but I can't quite put my finger on what it could be. Ah, oh, Squirt, are those worms? Please tell me you're going fishing. <laughs> there, there. Uh, Ixnay on the ishing thing? I'm a papa, guys. Worm brood, meet my best pals. Guys, meet worm brood. Congratulations, Papa. Quick, make them do something else. Oh, make them do something? Yes. What you do? Uh, Cornelius finds your anti-worm views offensive. My precious babies aren't here to entertain you. Parasitic belly button worms are people, too. Uh, no, they're not. They're worms. Whatever! We are out of here! Come on, guys! Let's slither away angrily! Wait, oh. how? Oh, well, was I too hard on them? It's not their fault that they don't get my new worm responsibilities. I'm a family man now. Right, Cornelius? Don't waste another minute on those... those humans, Papa. <sighs> Besides, worms can do much more than mere humans. Please, our Papa, with sustenance. <laughs> what humans were we talking about again? Tell me and Squirt share milkshakes. What? Squirt likes backwash. Hey, that's how me and Squirt said we'd ride a worm canoe. You know, if we had a worm canoe. That's our grub, grubs! Hey, that's the way me and Squirt. Uh, I. No, I got nothing for that one. Open up! Hold on, McGee. Only 9,998 of my babies still need to go. Be patient. <laughs> Squirt, I didn't want to bring this up, but you've been spending a lot of time with your worms lately. <sighs> You're right, McGee. No one ever told me how hard it is to be a papa or to toilet train worms. No, they never do, pal. They never do. But hey, if you learned anything today, it's this very important lesson. Dudes before broods. So you're telling me to abandon my babies for you? How selfish! If you'll excuse me, I have some responsibilities to get back to! Oh, good job. Now that's how you use a potty. I hope you're listening, McGee! Uh, this whole brood thing is getting totally out of hand. We have to do something to remind Squirt that he can't choose those worms over us. What setting do you think works better on worm smoothies? Liquify? Ooh, disintegrate. <gasps> Atomize. Hmm. Yeah, how about we just go and talk to Squirt this time? Fine, but no backwash sharing. Squirt, I'm really sorry about what I said before. So why don't all of us, including the worms, hang out and have some fun together? Sorry, McGee, but as you can see, the worms need their papa. Oh, come on. These worms look like they need some real fun, huh? Hey, check this out. <laughs> okay, so that wasn't as much fun as wrestling with the mutant chipmunk, but... Cornelius thinks you're incredibly cruel, and your attempts at fun are totally lame. And I agree. <laughs> Okay, that's it! Time to blend me up a worm fruit smoothie! Oh, scaring innocent worm babies, Gretch? Uh, I can see McGee doing that, but you? For shame! For shame! Come on, kids! We're leaving! <laughs> oh, wait, come back, Squirt! Come back! <laughs> That's not polite. Stop it! Stop it right now! Don't make me come over there! I'm counting to three! One! Two! Two and a half! Three! Yeah. Squirt! Remember, dudes before broods! Forever! No, oh, that's it! You're making me come over there now! I think I made a big mistake here! Silly, Papa. 
Soon all of your worries will depart. Once we feed on your delicious brain, you won't be able to worry again. Phew! I love not worrying. Wait, what? Surely you know worm broods always feed on their papa. And it is their papa's duty to be fed upon. Ah! 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 I cannot believe that worked! <laughs> My wormy cookie dough! Oh, need cookie dough energy to fight worms! Protect our papa! Hey! That's our papa! We used out of his intestines first! Oh, you so did not! Did too! Double brood stamped it! I'm gonna miss you guys. Sorry about your battling broods. You are right, McGee. Nothing should have ever come between us. Why don't we just pretend today never happened and just start over? <laughs> Squirt, no! Hmm. Ah, nothing like a fresh start. Hey, I wonder if things will turn out any differently. <laughs> Please don't let the alien invasion start when I'm in my jam jams. Last level of alien camp invasion. High score, Butt Squad. That was just a video game? Wow, looks like Butt Squad's moving up in your high score battle, McGee. <laughs> He's so squatty after I nailed the ultimate high score yesterday. Ding, 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 ding. Huh? Huh? <gasps> Extra point bonus. Even higher ultimate high score. Butt Squad. Oh, come on. That's not fair. I think I know a way you can even the score. The high score, that is. Extreme Zombie Surf Apocalypse 4? Still in perfect condition. I saw it back here the last time I helped Sawyer fix his collapsed ribs. Ooh, ribs. Lips off, squirt. But I love spare ribs. <laughs> okay, it is pretty old school, but I figured if anyone can get the high score on this baby, it's you. Right, McGee? 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 Oh, yeah. I've seen this before. McGee is so focused on getting the high score, he can't even speak <laughs> or control his bodily functions. <laughs> so that's why my high score alarm went off. <laughs> McGee can waste his time on that lame old game, because I own this high score contest. I like so. Ow! Dang it! I got to get to that lame old game. Aha! Caught ya! You're not gonna out high score me without a fight! No! My Cowabunga Blast bonus gone! That was my last surfer! Well, I guess it's my turn! <laughs> nuh uh, not without me or not! Game on! Chamomily. Locally sourced, triple steep. Game back on! What? <laughs> no! What are you two doing? No time to talk. Beware. Yes. <laughs> you two have to stop. Some high scores aren't meant to be broken. Oh, great. Power failure. You two must have blown the camp generator. <laughs> ah, 
that's better. This fur isn't going to set and curl itself. That's it. Game over. <laughs> No ribs. Ah, uh, Lake Bottom is way more ultra lamoy than I even thought. I don't think we're in Lake Bottom anymore. Come on, Butt Squad, we gotta split. Relax, McGee. You just gotta know how to talk to the locals. Like so. Could you direct me to the rich part of the endless grid? <laughs> Oops. My dad will totally pay for that. Don't you see, Butt Spaz? It's just like the game! <laughs> now this is how you do it, Butt Squad. Check it! Double points! In your face, McGee! Triple points! Hey, Butt Squad. I think we should stop zombie smashing for a minute and just reflect on the enormity of actually being inside a video game. Mm. Yeah. <gasps> Five times ultra bonus point zombie power apple! Oh. Owie! Butt Squad! I totally called that zombie power apple first! Like I was gonna let you get the endless grid of doom high score! In your dreams! As if! Oh, seriously? Oh, it won't start! Ugh. We need to get that game running! Ugh. Or who knows what's gonna happen to McGee! But what if McGee never comes back? Who I swap undies with on undie trading day? Who? <gasps> what are you staring at, Squirt? Nothing, Gretch. You know, we really should get to know each other better. This is Extra Dream Zombie Surf Apocalypse 4. I am 1011101. But you can call me 1011001. I am programmed to protect the high score. All who ch ch challenge the high score are digitized. Now let me introduce our first high score challenger. Sawyer. I did try to warn you, campers. Oh, why do I get the feeling this is kind of my fault? Oh, yeah, kind of totally your fault. Anyway, a program is a program. <laughs> oh, easy, Gretch. Easy. Gretch? Gretch? Huh? You say something, Squirt? Now that's more like it. How are we supposed to get to know each other better with all that noise? Squirt, why don't we reconnect after I reconnect the power? Yes, now it's time for some Squirt Gretch quality reconnecting. <laughs> so, you do or don't want to swap undies then? Can you make up your mind, Gretch? <laughs> will be severed momentarily. While we wait, would you mind telling me what's been happening the last 30 years? Is this still a thing? Radical! Surf's up! Kick me right in the butt! Come on! What a beautiful moment! <laughs> hey -ya! Sawyer, time to use your head! Yeah. Ah, Mickey! Hands! Er, uh, heads up! Yeah, right! So he can get the all time zombie hand catching high score? Uh. What squat? What squat? No! No! <laughs> Just when I was starting to like that guy. <laughs> Emotions, McGee. You'll never get the high score with those things. What squat? But how? Obviously, my mad video game skills scored me an extra life. A duh. <gasps> Surf is up. Hmm. What show am I? 
them a real high score! Thanks for the lift, campers! Whoa! Take a little load off! Stay a while, like, uh... Forever! You think you can outscore me? I was programmed to never lose! But how? Well, first we got the power back on. Oh, the things I go through for my Sasquatch beauty regimen. And let's just say I evened the score with this. Yeah, as far as besties go, Gretchen gets the high score. High score? All who challenge the high score are... She has the new high score? Nah, uh -uh. Not if I can help it. Campers, wait up! You're my new bestie now, Rib. Such a delicious friend. <laughs>